the time I was working in Europe, in Holland, I always, I made up my mind, I said, my salary come from this company. And whatever, whatever I can do for this company, I will do it. Because my salary come from here. So I was not calculating my hours. I work extra hours. I do effort whatever I'm going to do. And one day, my director called me. He said, come. He took me to the office. And he said, I have watched you for more than two years here. And I've seen the department where you work how things have improved. I'm going to give you a salary. You're not qualified for that salary. But don't tell anybody. I'm giving you a salary. Don't tell anybody. I said, thank you, sir. And I left the place. And the Lord spoke to me. He said, he said what discipline can do. Because you see, a lot of people they come to work early in the morning. Instead of them going to work, they are drinking coffee, they are reading newspapers. It will take them three hours. I mean, there are people that waste three hours just not doing anything. Read newspaper, drink coffee, go to this department, go to this place, play a computer. And they will waste hours. And the owner of the job, that is where he pays you. How can you succeed if you are going to live like that? I said it to myself, I said, look, I dream to have a company one day, and whatever I'm doing here is a seed. And I don't want to sow a bad seed that will come back to me. I got to discipline myself because if I don't discipline myself now in this place, there is no way I'm going to discipline myself when I have my own business. And that is the problem. When people lack discipline working for other people, when they have their own business, the same character will follow them. They won't discipline themselves and they will be angry when they fail. And they will say, witchcraft about attacking. It's not witchcraft, it is lack of discipline. I know someone like that.